Wondering how to create a resume in Canva? In this Canva resume tutorial, you'll learn how to use Canva for beginners to create a CV in Canva. So let's get right into these Canva tricks and Canva tips for your Canva CV so that you can make a resume using Canva templates with ease. First off, if you don't have a Canva account yet, just click on the link in the description box below to sign up for free. To create a resume in Canva, in your Canva homepage, use the search bar up top to search for resume. You can either select a generic Canva resume template by clicking on the resume option or select a custom Canva resume template by selecting one of the other options, including minimalist resume, high school resume, scholarship resume, professional resume, photo resume, academic resume, corporate resume, college resume, and simple resume. You may notice that when I place my cursor next to each of these Canva resume templates, they're all appropriately sized for resumes. I'll go ahead and click on the first resume option. Canva has a number of resume templates that you can choose from, or you can click on Create a Blank Resume up top to start from scratch. You can also filter the Canva resume templates by theme, style, and color. Once you've located a resume template that you enjoy and want to customize to make it your own, click on it to edit it. You can either leave this Canva resume template style as is, or click on any of the icons on the left-hand side panel to edit this Canva design further so that it looks the way you wish. For more details on how to customize a design in Canva, make sure to watch my video on how to use Canva. I'll leave the link to it in the description box below. Let me just show you a few things you can do to customize this resume in Canva. To edit the text, just click on any text box and enter your information. You can also double-click on that text and change its font, size, color, style, alignment, additional options, line spacing, and effects. To change the design style of any of the elements on the Scanva resume, just click on that element you wish to change and then on the color picker from the white panel up top. You can either select one of the suggested colors or use the search bar up top to search for a specific color or hex code. To change this stock photo that came with the Canva resume template to one of your photos, click on Uploads from the left-hand side panel and either select one of the photos you've already added to Canva or click on Upload Media up top to add a new one. You can upload a new photo to your resume in Canva from your device, Facebook, Google Drive, Instagram, or Dropbox. Once you've located the photo you wish to add to your Canva resume, just drag and drop it over the current photo. To save the resume you created in Canva, rename your design up top, and then click on the download icon on the top right hand side. Select the file type, most likely PDF print or PDF standard, and additional options if you so wish, and then click on the download button at the bottom. If you're serious about learning more about how to create a resume in Canva, Make sure you check out our Canva Tutorials playlist for even more Canva tips and tricks, as well as our free cheat sheet with brilliant tools that you should use below this video to learn more about how to save time and boost your productivity in your online business. Leave a comment below and let me know if you'll be using Canva to create a resume. If you liked this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel so that you can navigate the tech side of online business with ease, and stay tuned for our next video, which is about how to hide likes and dislikes on YouTube. 
As you wait for our next video to go live, check out these two videos I have right here, and I'll see you in my next video.